given us mercy in a strong city. Breath of heaven has breathed on us. In anything that you do, do it with all your might and make sure that you fill your room, your office, anywhere you find yourself with the joy of the Lord. Listen, I've seen the salvation of the Lord in a time, and a trying time like this. God has shown me mercy. And I also believe that if you trust in Him, He will also show you mercy. Don't bother about the mountains that you see, the valleys, the crossroads, the crooked paths. It is for your making. And that making is not just for mere men. It's for a great personality because you carry a destiny in your womb. And such a people doesn't work as commoners. Hear me. God has heard your voice where you are weeping. God has heard your voice where you are lifting up your voice and making demands pertaining the things that are weighing you down and your desire according to his will. Hear what the Bible says and that's the conclusion of what the Father has for us this morning. That's the book of 2 Chronicles, Chronicles chapter 6 verse 41. It said, Now therefore arise, O Lord, into thy rest, thou and the ark of thy strength. Let thy priests, O God, be clothed with salvation, and let thy saints and people rejoice in thy goodness. Listen, everything that pertains to your, your, your greatness, your joy this morning has been handed. I proclaim to the ends of the earth and the portals thereof to release that which is your desire this morning in the name of Jesus.